Prince Harry drops some major bombshells against the royal family. Here's everything we learned in his memoir, Spare. The Duke of Sussex details a particularly gruesome fight with the Prince of Wales as their relationship grew strained after his wedding to Meghan in May of 2018. According to Harry, the altercation began when William allegedly called Meghan out for being difficult and rude in 2019. Harry claims that his brother grabbed him by the collar and broke his necklace before he knocked him to the floor. The Duke of Sussex revealed that he returned to the Paris tunnel where his mother, Princess Diana, died in 1997. After he emerged from the tunnel, he wrote, Quietly, I said, is that all of it? It's nothing, just a straight tunnel. He said he always imagined the tunnel to be treacherous and dangerous, but said no reason anyone should ever die inside. Prince Harry claims that he and William did not approve of his father marrying Camilla in 2005. He wrote, despite Willie and me urging him not to, Pa was going ahead. We pumped his hand, wished him well, no hard feelings. He wrote that they recognized that he was with the woman that he loved and the woman fate may have intended him to be with. Harry confirmed that he had used cocaine and even did chocolate mushrooms at Courtney Cox's house and detailed the inglorious episode of losing his virginity in a grassy field behind a busy pub with an older woman. He said that this older woman liked horses and treated him unlike a young stallion. He wrote, quick ride, after which she smacked my rump and sent me to grace. Harry wrote that Queen Elizabeth brought up Donald Trump when first meeting Meghan Markle, but that his brother William recoiled when given a hug by Meghan on their first meeting, since he didn't hug many strangers. However, he exchanged a few warm words with Meghan upon their first meeting, and he also revealed that William and Kate were religious viewers of suits. Prince Harry addressed the infamous 2005 incident where he wore a Nazi uniform to a costume party, but said that William and Kate encouraged him to wear the costume and howled when they saw him wearing it. For years, tabloids published stories about the rumors that Major James Hewitt was Harry's real father, a joke that Prince Charles allegedly enjoyed telling. He wrote, who knows if I'm even your real father? Maybe your real father is in Broadmoor, darling boy. He'd laugh and laugh, though it was a remarkably unfunny joke, given the rumor circulating just then that my actual father was one of Mummy's former lovers, Major James Hewitt. However, he did say that Princess Diana didn't meet Major James Hewitt until long after he was born. Harry recalled that Charles told him there wasn't enough money to go around for Meghan, despite Harry writing that Charles did not financially support he or his brother, but it is understood that if they serve the monarch, they will be taken care of. Harry wrote that it became clear that it wasn't about the money, writing, what he really couldn't stomach was someone new dominating the monarchy, grabbing the limelight, someone shiny and new coming in and overshadowing him and Camilla. He'd lived through that before and had no interest in living through it again. For more news content and exclusive interviews, make sure to hit the sub, like, and bell button down below and visit usmagazine.com.